Hi, my name is Belgica and I'm an actress based out of California and today I'm going to share with you a big open casting call that I found through the Casting Society of America and I'm just excited for you to hopefully get an opportunity. I wanted to make a video about it and tell you the importance of it because if you are newer to the industry or you saw it and you maybe don't know what it is, I just want to encourage you to do it. So the Casting Society of America has opened up a global, the whole world, anybody who identifies as Asian can submit to this casting call. And they have information on their Instagram and on their website. I'm gonna link all of their information in the description and I'm also going to feature their channel at the end of this video so you can go to their YouTube channel and check out a bunch of interviews they've been doing. They started their YouTube channel pretty recently, I think, because the the oldest video is just a few months old as of right now, June 2021. Interviews with actors and casting directors that were Asian on their YouTube channel talking about equity and representation. And they also had, of course, other people of color there. Definitely recommend if you're an actor, listen and watch a bunch of interviews with casting directors. Backstage has some. Um, I'm just going to leave another playlist, a link to a playlist for interviews with casting directors because they're the people that help us get our jobs, right? They're the people that we need to be collaborating with and building relationships with. And especially now, we are so lucky to be able to do this online. So this one in particular is going to be um, a self-tape audition request or a self-tape audition, basically. So uh, Casting Society of America this morning announced that they're doing a big open casting call and you do have to use the link in their description, which again, I will link everything in my description, sorry, the link in their bio of their Instagram. Um, definitely follow them on Instagram for future opportunity. The Casting Society of America is not just in America, there's also members from all over the world. It's The Casting Society is not a union. Um, it's something that I learned about recently. It's a society, it's a group, it's a club, it's a group of people you know that work in the casting world. So casting directors and associates are part of the society and can become part of the society. And it's essentially just a big group of people that come together and do beautiful things and based off of their website and all of the information that I was able to gather it's a place where they can represent casting directors professionally and get good information and share things with each other and right now it looks like they are trying to work to get more representation of people of color on film and tv not only in this country but every other country because although their name is casting society of america apparently they have people from all over the world if you just want me to tell you like okay so who's in it like at least tell me somebody that's in it Carmen, Carmen Cuba, Carmen Cuba, um, she is a casting director of things like Stranger Things. I've talked about her before. I've made a video about her. Um, she's in it. Uh, Car uh, Carla Hul, who I have also talked about, who um, did a lot of castings as well, but uh, Hintified, Narcos. Uh, there's just so many things that both of those women have done, but they're just two of the members of the society. So it's it's a pretty you know big deal that the casting society of america is doing a big open casting call they did not say what they're going to do with these submissions but being that they have so many members and so many people that cast tv film um you know online things theater all of that they are likely to look through a bunch of them filter them out and then share them uh, in some kind of portal or share them with casting directors in general that are looking for, you know, specifically Asian actors. Um, and, you know, what kind of Asian are they looking for? Filipinos? Are they looking for people from um, a Southeast Asian? So it's really cool that they are opening this up. And so let me tell you a little bit about the information that they have on their Instagram and on their website. Essentially, they're going to ask you to do a self tape. So I'm assuming they're going to give you some kind of sides or request that you perform the sides that you want. And they're going to also ask you a question about what visibility means to you as an Asian actor, Asian American actor or whatever other kind of Asian that you might be, which is really great because not only are you auditioning as an actor, but you are sharing your beliefs and how you want to be represented. It's really cool how they're opening up the doors to not only hear you as a performer, see you as a performer, but see what you are about. And if you are passionate about your culture, about representation, then you can show it in this tape. In order to enter first, you have to register with the link in their bio. So on their Instagram bio, there's a link. You can go there and then it will take you through a registration process. It'll ask you for contact information, your 
name, your location, um, and then if you have any ADA requests, any uh, modifications that you need them to do. And then it says that after there, they will send you the specific instructions within 48 hours so that you can submit to the self tape. So I'm not Asian American. So I didn't go through that process, but if you happen to have a YouTube channel, you're an actor, or you just want to document this, I highly encourage you to document the process and share it with other Asian actors because this is giving you the opportunity to get in front of other casting directors, um, big casting directors. And again, they didn't mention exactly how they're going to be using this information, but being that it is such a big society and it's been around for something like 50 years, 40 years, something like 40 years, um, you know, they have a lot of members, a lot of big members. So I highly encourage you to do this. I have a lot of videos about self-tape auditions. If you need help, if you want to watch them, I have playlists about self-tape auditions. And um, for the questionnaire portion, I just encourage you to be honest. If you aren't, you know, as crazy passionate about representation, like what are you passionate about as being um, seen? We all have different experiences. Don't feel shy about sharing your truth. Um, because I know casting directors, that's what they want to see. They want to see your acting abilities and then they want to see who you really are if you're going to be somebody who's um, they can trust to get the job done, somebody who they can trust to be professional on set. And this is open for both union and non-union actors. If you don't know what that means, don't worry about it, then you're not union. But if you want to learn about at least SAG-AFTRA, I also have videos about that. If you do end up submitting to this open casting call, please let me know in the comments. I would be so excited to know that some of you found out about it through me because I just want to give you information and, you know, allow you to be able to, to do this because this, I, I really like being an actress and it's super hard. And if you're in it for the money, girl, get out of here. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. And like I said, here is Casting Society of America's a YouTube channel if you want to check out their conversations with actors and casting directors and at the end of every video I do feature another channel that's today's channel and if you would like to be featured on my next video make sure you're subscribed like this video and leave me a comment about what your channel's about if you want me to say something about your channel